Thank you very much. As we remain on our feet, we are going to honor the national anthem. Murakoze chane, murakanya lero tuji agaze tuji yekuwa iriza indiri mboi jiugu. Murakoze. much. You may get seated. Honorable Minister, Chancellor of Rwanda Polytechnic, you may now constitute this gathering into a congregation. Thank you very much. By the virtue of the authority entrusted to me, I constitute this gathering into a congregation. Thank you very much. Honorary Minister, distinguished guests, our dear ones, parents, friends, family, ladies and gentlemen, a very warm welcome to this celebration of today. It's the third graduation ceremony for Rwanda Polytechnic and a total of 2,398 are going to graduate from different, from eight IPRCs, from different programs and disciplines. Of those, we have 75% male and 25% female. And on a special note, we also have our beloved teachers who are seated that side. They have been going through an intensive training for TVET trainer training, and they're also going to receive their TVET trainer certificates today. I must say, congratulations, dear graduates, and good luck in the life ahead of you. And thank you very much, Honorable Minister, dear invited guests, to allow to grace our function today. The program still maintained as it is in the booklets. And on that note, Honorable Minister, allow me to invite the Vice Chancellor of Rwanda Polytechnic for his opening and welcoming remarks. Thank you very much. Uh, Honorable Minister of Education, 
Honorable Senators here present with us, Honorable Members of Parliament, uh, representatives of uh, diplomatic corps and international organizations, a representative of City of Kigali, and representative of uh, Mayor of Kichukira, uh, DG WDA, representative of DG Reb, representatives of security organs, and representatives of higher learning institutions here present, development partners, dish, distinguished guests, RP staff and students, graduating class of 2019, ladies and gentlemen, I greet you. Good morning. Uh, I'll start with a few comments in Kinyarwanda for the sake of uh, uh, our participants who don't understand English. Kanhangire magambo mache mu Kinyarwanda hanyuma ngiri byo mvuga mu cyongereza. Ah uh, mfashe kugira ngo mbashimire cyane cyane uh, kuba mwaje kwifatanya natwe kuri uyu munsi. Turanezerewe cyane kuba mwaje gushyigikira abanyeshuri abaretsi ndetse n'abayobozi ba Rwanda Polytechnic muri ibi birori byitangwa ry'impamya bushobozi ku nshuro ya gatatu muri Rwanda Polytechnic rishuri kuru ry'imyuga n'ubumenyiro ndashimira by'umwe hariko abanyeshuri bashoje amasomo yabo uyu munsi mu mashami atandukanye muri za IPS 8 zigize ikigo cyacu cya RP iyi ni intambwe ikomeye mu buzima bw'abanyeshuri bagiye guhabwa impamya bushobozi nimwe mu nzira ibaganisha ku isoko by'umurimo kugira ngo batangire kwihangira muri imirimo kwiteza imbere ndetse no guteza igihugu cyacu imbere muri rusange nyakwa ministre bakitsi bahire mwese muteraniye hano uyu munsi ibyishimo byacu bifite impamvu kuko twishimira umusaruro twagezeho uh, wo guha impamya bushoboza abanyeshuri bagera ku bihumbi bibiri magana atatu na mirongo icyenda n’umunani banyeshuri uyu munsi ni uwanyu mwarakoze cyane kandi mwongere mwihe amashyi n’impondo turashimira kandi ikindi gikorwa komeye cyo guha impamya bushobozi abari mu bativet bagera ku igihumbi 1785 bahuguwe mu kwigisha mu buryo bugezweho bwa competence based trainings and competence based assessment mwarakoze cyane namwe banyeshuri mwarangije uyu munsi turabasaba kuzashyira ibyo mwize mu bikorwa kandi muzabikore nk'abanyamwuga kandi muzarangwe ni ndanga gaciro z'umuco nyarwanda aho muzakora hose kugira ngo muzabe ingira kamaro banyakubahwa banyakubaha banyakubaha bashitsi bahire turashimira cyane leta yacu iyobowe n'intori izirusha intamwe perezida wacu Paul Kagame kubw'imbaraga nyinshi zashyizwe mu mashuri y'imyuga n'ubumenyi ngiro ndetse no 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 gushikiriza urubyiruko kwiga no gushishikariza urubyiruko kwiga imyuga turashimira leta yacu cyane Turashimira kandi abafatanye bikorwa bose bacu badufasha mu kubaka amashuri guhugura abarimo gutanga ibikoresho mu mashuri gufasha abanyeshuri kwimenyereza umwuga mu nganda n'ibindi byinshi Turashimira kandi abarimo ndetse n'ababyeyi kubwitange bagize mu buryo butandukanye kugira ngo aba bana bacu babashe kwiga neza mwarakoze mwese cyane reka nibutse abanyeshuri ko impamya bushobozi zanyu muza muza gufata mu kanya 
uh, oya reka nibutse abanyeshuri ko impamya bushobozi nangwa sezo twakwise diploma certificates muzaza kuzifata mu cyumweru gitaha ku mashuri ku bigo mwigaho uh, muza shikane nabayobozi banyo ntabwo bizaginda muzifate hanyuma mugende mwiyubake ndabashimiye mwese mugire amahoro Honourable Minister, uh, Honourable uh, Senators, Honourable Members of Parliament, Representatives of Diplomatic Corps, International Organizations, I want now to say a few things in English. It is, it is with great pleasure to welcome you all to the third graduation of Wanda Polytechnic. This is a, triumph, a triumphal day for you, the graduating class of 2019, for your families and for all of us. This is a day for smiling and cheering, and let's join in a big round of applause for this third RP graduation. I congratulate you. <clears throat> Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, today we are celebrating the third RP graduation where 2,398 students are going to be awarded their diplomas and advanced diplomas certificates in different fields of engineering and other programs. 75% of them are male and 25% are female. That's not a record, Honourable Minister, we are very proud of. Only 25% and in some trades, much lower. I can I promise you that we are going to work this to increase the number of females attending our programs. We are also celebrating the award of 1,784 TVET trainer certificates for trainers who underwent Grand TVET Trainer Institute or RTTI programs in 2018. So far, RP has achieved a lot since it became operational in February 2018. The Rwanda TVET Trainer Institute was launched on 26th of April 2018 and now fully operational. It will support much more on the skills upgrading of TVET trainers with more focus on ICT, pedagogy, English, and technical skills. In November 2018, the Mineduc, through Rwanda Polytechnic and TVET stakeholders, organized a regional Africa skills competition under the auspices of the World Skills Competition, and Rwanda competitors won the majority of the medals. The Kappa, or Commonwealth Association of Polytechnic, um, Polytechnics in Africa conference was organized in August 2019, which was attended by various polytechnic institutions from different parts of Africa. So far, Rwanda Polytechnic has graduated two cohorts, respectively, 1,882 on 28th June 2018, and 2,088 earlier this year, uh, on March 23rd, March, Today we are graduating, as I said, 2000, almost 2,400. So we are on a good trajectory, we are doing well, and we hope that by 2024 we shall be graduating a much larger number to tackle the economic, um, the economic development of the country. A total number of 1,784 trainers are, have been trained in CBTCBA, and as I mentioned, we are going to honor them today. And I want to thank Tiapu Fund uh, of Koika for your great contribution. For the first time, Mineduke RP have conducted the national examinations based on CBTCBA approach, and um, we are pleased with the progress, and we are going to continue our efforts in that direction. We are also celebrating, Honourable Minister, the establishment of Positivo Repair Centres in five IPRCs. So all the Positivo um, laptops are going to be maintained and repaired by our Polytechnics. The Rwanda Coding Academy was established and now hosted in Nyabihu Tivet School. They are in the first year. They will be finishing their first year, end of this year. Honorable Minister, ladies and gentlemen, 
RP is planning to implement competence-based training and assessment at higher levels than level five. That means in at diploma program, we are also going to conduct um, CBT, CBA. We really acknowledge the efforts that the government has been putting in Tibet for transforming uh, Rwandan youth into competitive and skilled workforce for both regional and global labor market. According to NST1, Tivet's system is expected to absorb 60% of uh, uh, year nine, uh, nine year basic education leavers by 2024, where this target is at present on at 31. Dear graduates, as philosopher Osho says, your whole education prepares you and makes you ready for to fight. You are now about to face the world armed with the most potent weapon. That weapon, contrary to what some of you may think, is not the certificate you are going to receive today, but the skills you have acquired in your training. Knowledge and skills, uh, knowledge and skills generation is systematic. It is strategic, it takes much physical, mental, and even sometimes emotional exertion. But the good thing is that while your certificate can get lost, stolen, or destroyed by fire, knowledge and your skills can neither be taken away from you nor depleted. Honorable Minister, ladies and gentlemen, I'm very encouraged by the partnership and collaboration of our, inst of our institution and the industry, as well as development partners. In a very special way, I wish to recognize and thank all our development partners who are contributing a lot to the achievement of RP mission and the companies which have responded positively to our calling for sponsoring the event and awarding corporate prizes to the best performing students in different fields of the programs. Dear graduates, so soon you are going to be graduates as you pursue your various paths after leaving here. It is my hope you shall continue in your brilliance and energy to bring further pride to your families and the country at large. Congratulations once again and, uh, and enjoy the rest of the day. Let me remind the graduating students that your diploma certificates will be available for pickup next week at your respective IPRCs. I thank you all again. Thank you, everyone, for coming. Arakoze Chane, Vice Chancellor, Kugija Mbodi Kaze, Atujejeho. Thank you very much. Vice Chancellor, for the welcoming remarks. Uh, with your permission, Honorable Minister, allow me to invite the famous Inganzongari to have a short entertainment session. Mufashe Twachire Inganzongari Kujirango Zidususurus.
Thank you very much. Banye shuli lero tujeze muli wa muanya. Nyiri zina. Woku hawa imam ya ushobo zizanyo. Changu imam ya mwenye zanyo. This is your day. This is your moment. Your moment has come. Enjoy it. And have fun. Honorable Minister. We have come to the moment for confirmation of diplomas and advanced diplomas. But before that, we are first going to recognize the trainers from RTTI who are also going to get their TV trainer certificates. And on that note, please allow me to invite the Deputy Vice Chancellor for Under Polytechnic to take us through that activity. Thank you very much. Honorable Minister of Education, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, the, the government of Rwanda, through the Minister of Education, Workforce Development, and the Rwanda Polytechnic, aims at providing high quality technical vocational education and training. 
to its citizens to ensure the achievement of national development goals. It is in that framework that uh, throughout uh, the intervention of training of trainers, the total number of in service, in service TVT trainers who received TVT trainer certificate course was 2,178. Out of them, the total number of RTTI did trainers and trainees who were verified to get certified in TVT trainer certification course was 1,700. And 85. This is equivalent to approximately 40 percentage, 40 percent of the total number of TVT trainers in Rwanda. It is in this framework that we want to recognize them. They are sitting on slot number 112. May I request them to stand up for recognition? Honorable Minister of Education, these are representing the TVT trainers, but they are not all of them because others are conducting TVT uh, examinations, especially practical examinations. That is why you see few of them, but uh, we recognize their efforts and we congratulate them and expect to get more input in providing CBT, CBA. Congratulations. And please join your seats. Thank you. Honorable Minister, I want to proceed with the award of diploma certificates. Mr. Chancellor, sir, I have the pleasure to invite the principal of IPRC Musanze to present to you to present to you the graduates who satisfied all the academic requirements for the award of advanced diploma in agriculture engineering and advanced diploma in irrigation and water engineering. Thank you. Dear graduates, I rise up when I call your program. Mr. Sir, I have the honor to present to you the graduates who satisfied all the academic requirements for the award of advanced diploma in agriculture engineering in the following programs, agriculture and food processing, crop production technology, veterinary technology, and advanced diploma in irrigation and water engineering in the program of irrigation and drainage technology. Mr. Chancellor, sir, here are the graduates who fulfilled all the academic requirements for the award of advanced diploma in agriculture engineering and advanced diploma in irrigation and water engineering. Congratulations. By virtue of authority entrusted to me, I confer upon those persons who satisfied all the academic requirements, the award of advanced diploma in agriculture engineering. Congratulations.
ne abayobozi basubira mu gicaro thank you very much honorable minister and if your authorization is sir i wanted to let you know that in addition in addition to these awards provided by Rwanda Polytechnic to the best performers we have also different partners from the private sector who regularly contribute to the success of TV delivery in different areas. Some of these partners are here and they wish also to congratulate these graduates and to provide them with additional support in their new career which is starting today. Babjei Mutarani Yahano, Mukwiji Shunyoganu Menjiro Tunafatanya Kandi Nabi Korera, Uryo Tano Kanye, Bangu Mwoto Fatanya, Mwafatanya Vikorwa Ba Chwari Mubi Korera, Barihano, Baje Korewa Nabo, Ababanye Shri Ba Chwarangi Shri Monsi, Kukone Waza Naba Koresha, Ariko Bani Fuje Kujira, Vijizo Wabi Furiza, No Kujiri Vijo Waba Jenera, Jaza Wafasha, Mujihe Chirimberi. Najirango Ufte Maike Ejere, Afatanya Vikorwa Ba Chwu, Ufte Kampani Zika Kuchenda, Zaime Ye Kujiri Chos Tanga, Naje Naho Makara Imge Imge Uhari Tromoha, umunoto mwe gusa wakutubugira kampani ye nicho beme ye gutanga. Tulahi lakuli kampani ya Algorithm Inch LTD. Uwe hakarari ye, ni wahari ya Algorithm, ni wahari ya agu kasi mwaku uzano enda kujilango unganya utatawumara wenda wachana sawa kujila hindu kwa hajeze. Murakoze, jini tukwa chime nye wabre nye ura asosiete, tukwa Algorithm, Dukora software yetu aishiga, turishi mje chanya leo kwa na namu yumunsi, ni mwenyewe muzatu matu kwa guka, kujira ngo dufata ni na EPRC, dufita wakosi, wafu yuanyu, bakora ni zako kushawo mo ni universite, ni hamash, ni biza ni biza kumu muri pratik, teori teori na na chini mazee muri muri innovation, so. Icyo twa twemeye guha IPRC no guha stage abana babiri muri ICT muri software uwa mbere tukamuha laptop murakoze arakoze cyane uhagarariye vision garment vision garment yatambuka babyeyi honorable minister graduates muraho nitwa Richard Rutesire the managing director of Vision Government, Vision Government, Ikori Mienda, Uniforms, Ni Mienda Wanyar Gwanda Mwari Rusanji. Tukifu Shagu Shimira, Rujiro Kororanjije, Kantu Nawa Shimira Ko Mwashwe Kui Hangana Mukaranji Zama Somo, Mwashwe Kui Sokor Jumurim. Tasha Kwa Kwa Watinga, the best two performers, Mwari Programming. Trawaha Laptop, Kantu Trawaha Professional Internship, Yishurbu. Trava Chirie, Yirango, Tiza Kamele, Yosei Karapi, Aza Zai Fati. Ako Zai Chane, Tua Shimire, Tua Chira Kampani, Anatikom. Murakoze, Honorable Ministers, Nabandiwa Yosei Wosei Murihano, Yewe Nitu Kwa Kevine, Vajeneza, Havanyo Wora Kampani, Anatikom, IT Center, Itangu many professional courses, short courses, and capacity building. Mwa no barangije ICT. Oyomusi tu kabado hai award. Awa na hichumi the best performers, but mostly girls because we want to empower young girls to take STEM careers. Thank you. Tuwakuli chizaho kampani yitwa Isoko Connection. Murakozi, nitwa Umulisa Mediatrist. Mwabna jema garari kampani yitwa Dynamic Business Group. Mwabandi Managing Director with Soko Connection Limited, Ikore Ramori Dynamic Business Group. Mbere na mbere mbanje gushimira mshubo sibari hano kuhunamge vate. Nga kampani ya chu, tu 
tukaba twifuje ku paid professional scholarship ku banyeshuri batanu murakaze Kuchizeko kampani ya Trust. Mna kuzetia ne, nitwa vini se tukua jira mungu, hawa nyo wala kampani tukua Trust Engineering Solutions, mwini short tuita Trust. Ibiyo dukora, dukora services zijanye na installations za telecommunication yuku minara yitu manapu. Ariko nje kujitichu, kujiticha nje jumi hariko, Hawa mfiti nyungu mungu kora na nuru bjiruko kujirango i sektor ya telekomunikasyo ikorgu wa machi ya nama nyama hanga IPRC zidufashe tulebuko kwa konjera wa nyaragu anda wazi kora mu mu liga huna haba nifujeko haba nabane baba hanga bifuza kuza kora muru yu munga kuburyo kujie chire chire na za wafata ngawa internship zishurwa Jana shoko ka baba ya wahanga cha netu kwa wakazi mara kuzi. Tia tuko ni kampani ya 250 startup. Hello, how are you, Minister? My name is Charles Shaka, and I'm general manager of 250. First of all, congratulations to all of you, and welcome to the real world. You need to work hard now. Uh, I run an incubation program, an acceleration program, where we support tech innovators. And today, we are going to give uh, the service, which is co-working space, transport and lunch, all experts, mentors, for the six months starting from de December, for two innovators. In addition to it, uh, the one they have been awarded today. That means we'll take three. So thank you very much and enjoy. Thank you very much, Honorable Minister. Usi mjizi kampani za wa shekone kuye monsi, dufite zini kampani ya zo, zita wa shekone kuhakira kwa liko za tutumye. Hali kampani ya Rio Contractor, yeme kutanga imyanyi tanu ya internship, haba ya za ikura wa kishirugwa, nyima yaho waka hapa kazi. Hali kampani ya NPD Kotrako, the same na yo za tanga internship kwa nyeshu iwane, nyima yaho na wo waba hakazi. Chimge na kampani ya Uzul, na yo yeme kufasha unga na mkoga uize manufacturing technology ikamu wa internship nyuma ya huna bugo waka muha akazi na yangu tushimile izi kampani zo semuru sanje tunashimile na wanyo shiva chuo sabitu kwa inezo mula koze chana thank you very much and congratulations Kunda shichirwa, mwese, mudutee shariri yiza, wajenziba nyuhano wa mgeeko, kunda shichirwa na guziba masomo gusa, na bobiti. Thank you very much, Deputy Vice Principal. Thank you very much, our partners, and thank you very much, Honorable Minister. Honorable Minister, with your permission, allow me to invite Inga Anzongari again for a very short entertainment session. Thank you very much. Inganzongari. Ingganzongari. <laughs> Ye karame na no, karame mushumbu a jiginya, nyanga mutindo tuwa mundwe na mbe murwanda. Wow. 
Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Inganzongari. Thank you very much, Inganzongari. Turabazi, they never disappoint. Honorable Minister, uh, the graduates in front of you are very thankful. They would like to extend their note of appreciation, appreciation to the leadership of this country, which you represent now, and in particular your ministry, and the management and staff of Rwanda Polytechnic, as well as their parents. Babie yi washitsi bahire tugeze mwanya yuko aje ni bacu bari kuza gushimira gushimira ubuyobozi bw'iki gihugu gushimira mwegwe ababye yi gushimira ikigo bizemo cha Rwanda Polytechnic ni shuti nababye yose kugira ngo uyu munsi bashobwe kugeraho with your permission honorable minister let me invite the representative of these graduates today to extend their appreciation. Thank you very much. Honorable Minister of Education, August of Honor, Vice Chancellor of Rwanda Polytechnic, principals from Rwanda Polytechnic College, lecturers, parents, and guardians, my fellow graduates, all MBTs, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. There is an African proverb that reads, that it takes the whole village to raise one child. The meaning of this proverb is that bringing up of a child is a tremendous effort that can only be successfully completed, not only by a single person, but a commitment of a community. In the spirit of that African proverb, I want you to realize on this momentous occasion that the government of Rwanda has invested a lot to give us knowledge and skills. And my fellow graduates, now we should take responsibility and give back to the community. Honorable Minister, my name is Olivier Iradukunda. I am graduating with an advanced diploma in electrical and electronics engineering. And together with my fellow graduates, we would like to express our gratitude to the government of Rwanda for the policy of increasing the number of students joining TIVET. And mostly for the establishment of Rwanda Polytechnic, which brought all IPRCs under one umbrella. This has resulted to the harmonization of thoughts programs. We are so indebted to our parents and guardians. 
who have constantly encouraged us throughout this journey with words of wisdom and affirmation. And most importantly, their financial and emotional support was indescribable. What we are today and what we may become to tomorrow, it is all from the sacrifices our parent has made for us. To our lecturers and instructors here present, your tireless work has paved a way for each and every student of Rwanda Polytechnic to have the relevant knowledge, skills, and most importantly, to have the right attitude. Thank you very much. Last but not the least, to my fellow graduates gathered here. First of all, congratulations to you all. We have reached this success through hard work, discipline, and commitment during our training. You should be proud of yourselves. Honorable Minister, there are so many notable accomplishments achieved by students from Rwanda Polytechnic. If allowed, I would like to share the recent one that happened in August this year. During the Youth Conference of Commonwealth Association of Technical Universities and Polytechnics in Africa, Kappa, Rwanda Polytechnics managed to win all the first three prizes in Startup, Startup Africa Talent and Innovation Challenge. I think we should clap for that. This has been an eye-opening to us and, and will encourage us to work on innovative ideas that will contribute to the economy of our country. We thank the, gov the government of Rwanda for different opportunities that expose us to the international level, that provided us the opportunity to benchmark our skills and knowledge. Graduates from IPRC College are capable of being job creators, but they need more support through incubation centers that can cater for the different training areas offered by Rwanda Polytechnic. To allow smooth transition from TVET institutions to the labor market, we'd like to request from, for more cooperation between Rwanda Polytechnic and the private sector so that we can all have access to internship that will improve our professionalism and competitiveness. Financial support to students and young graduates during industrial attachment and internship is also needed. We thank the government of Rwanda that has recognized TVET graduate having advanced diploma as indicated in the gazetted presidential order of job profile, whereby on some positions, both graduates with advanced diploma and bachelor's degree are given equal chances to apply. However, some institutions have not yet updated their organizational structure and job profile to take that into consideration would also request for, advo for advocacy to professional and regulatory bodies to enforce and employing qualified workers and ensure the implementation of the standards. Honorable Minister, as we all know, education has no limit, no boundaries. Some TVET graduates with advanced diploma wish to continue their studies leading to academic qualification with practical skills. We would like to request the Ministry of Education to introduce professional bachelor's degree program to enroll them. Nelson Mandela said, and I quote, that education is the single most powerful weapon you can use to change the world. 
And I would add on and say that education that leads to hands-on skill and, and professionalism is the master key to unlock all the opportunities throughout this journey of changing the world and make it a better place to live on. My fellow graduates, let me tell you that our country is ready for us to come with every tool we've been equipped during our time at college. And remember that you have all it takes to sustain and contribute to the development of our country. I leave you today with the words of Dwayne Michael Carter Jr. Every finish line is the beginning of the new race. We are celebrating the end of our journey at college, but remember that the real journey of sustaining and contributing to the development of our country starts right now. So tighten your shoe race, stand tall, and get ready to contribute to the development of our country. And always remember that you are the hero of your story. And a hero may lose few battles, but they always win the war. Thank you all for blessing us today with your presence. May God bless you. Thank you very much for being thankful. Babyeyi bashitsi bateraniye hano tugeze mu mwanya wo kumva ijambo n'ubutumwanya mukuru buyu munsi tugiye kugezwaho n'umushitsi wacu mukuru Minister of Education. Ladies and gentlemen, it is that time of having the keynote from the guest of honor who is also the Minister of Education. May I call upon the Vice-Chancellor of Rwanda Polytechnic to invite for us our Honorable Minister for his keynote. Thank you very much. Uh, Honorable Minister, it's my great pleasure to invite you, but before I ask you to come up, I wanted to say something. Uh, there will be senators here and other people who attended the 2018 national retreat at Gabiro. And in that national retreat, the subject of education, Iremed Yuburezi, came up again that why is it that Rwanda is doing extremely well in all indices of measurement, but when it comes to education, we are not among the top three or four, as Rwanda likes to always place herself. So in that, Herero, our minister, made a commitment that this is going to change. And honorable minister, we want to acknowledge that the effort, the war, the battle we are on, we are behind you. I know sometimes we put a lot of pressure on us, and that pressure goes on to my principles but it's a war that we are fighting and i'm sure in a few years that condemnation of saying that education is still ranking law is going to change so honorable minister i want to acknowledge you as i i ask you to come to the podium and address the congregation at the other podium please thank you Distinguished delegates, the Vice Chancellor of Rwanda Polytechnic, Deputy Vice Chancellors of Rwanda Polytechnic, leaders of higher learning institutions that have attended this graduation ceremony, principals of various IPRCs, development partners, government 
and private sector delegates that have attended this graduation ceremony, Rwanda Polytechnic staff and students, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. On behalf of the government of Rwanda, I would like to congratulate Rwanda Polytechnic, but particularly the class of 2019 of Rwanda Polytechnic for tremendous achievement they have demonstrated today. I would like to say that this is an important milestone that helps you to go into the workplace. It is a time that you are starting a new life altogether to serve your communities and to serve your nation. Let me first of all congratulate your parents, your guardians, your friends, your spouses and relatives that have devoted their time, their resources to support you throughout your training and specifically during the training of the course of Advanced Diploma Program and TVET Trainer Certificate Program. I would like at this moment to commend the Government of Rwanda decision to support TVET training because it is well enshrined in the Government of Rwanda policies in Vision 2050, National Strategy for Transformation, that TVET is one of the major areas that is going to help our nation grow. I thank the visionary leadership of His Excellency President Paul Kagame for his vision and support to the education sector, particularly to the TVET sector. I know that the graduation ceremony is time to celebrate achievements. It's time to look back and see what we have achieved as graduates, as an institution of higher learning, but it is also important for us to start thinking in terms of our contribution as those who have graduated towards our nation in various ways, and all through Rwanda Polytechnic and through various IPRCs. The government of Rwanda is very committed to supporting TVET section as a major area, and so there have been many vibrant opportunities to support innovation that will help TVET as a sector to grow. If you consider major pillars that are going to help drive our economy going forward, entrepreneurship, innovation, and collaboration are very pertinent to development. And therefore, our government has done a lot in terms of supporting these areas. You certainly know the platform and the forum of Rwanda Innovation City, you certainly know a strong private partnership, academia and financial development through incubation centers that have been developed across all IPRCs. You know several other opportunities that have been put forward by the government of Rwanda to support inter entrepreneurship and innovation. I am quite aware that you know the electronic world trade platform opportunity that His Excellency President Paul Kagame launched with Alibaba Group that will support entrepreneur spirit and opportunities for our graduates. We also know that Rwanda Polytechnic has done a lot in terms of identifying 
the best talents and started, for instance, Rwanda Coding Academy, Africa Digital Media Center, and other opportunities that will support you as you go forward to work in your communities and support our nation going forward. These are some of the major opportunities we want to upload because the government has put in a lot of effort to make them happen. We also know that there are specific funds through National Council for Science and Technology, the Rwanda Innovation Fund, that are opportunities for you as you go to work so that you utilize these funds for innovation. Ladies and gentlemen, the opportunities that are out there for our graduates are many. But certainly, our training institution and the government at large will continue to help them. Certainly, there are challenges we still have in the TV sector, but we see a lot of opportunities. The Rwanda Polytechnic has started elegant, competence-based training and assessment that is very promising. Rwanda Polytechnic, as you have witnessed, has graduated a number of people under RTTI. And as you heard from one of the graduates' representative, Rwanda Polytechnic won several awards recently during a competitive process whereby our students got best innovations. These are some opportunities that you have, and these are some of the opportunities that I think, we think are pertinent to help you as you go to the field. However, the challenges are many, but the good news is that our nation will always help you throughout your aspiration so that you achieve a lot in terms of supporting several innovations that we have outlined. One of the challenges we have is low numbers of enrollment rate in STEM overall, but specifically for girls students. You could see from the numbers that only 25% of girls graduate. We want to thank our development partners for the support they extend to the TVET sector and particularly those that help education of girls in TVET and sciences at large. This is very recommendable and be aware that the government will continue to work with you to ensure that you continue to support the TVET sector, particularly the training of girls in sciences and TVET. Many of the development partners have worked with us. And I want to say that we know that you work tirelessly to help in terms of infrastructure development, in terms of skills building, in terms of availability of learning resources. We thank you for your support, and we promise that we shall all the time support you to achieve your ambitions as we move together towards the journey of economical transformation of Rwanda through TVET training. Let me thank the partners that have extended various internship opportunities to TVET students that are the best. This is highly recommendable and we will continue to work together with you to support your efforts as you move forward. Finally, let me thank all the parents, the guardians, and those who have helped these students that have graduated today. And I would like to reiterate our commitment as government to always support TVET and the science sector to grow in our country because we know it is an important 
pillar for social economical development of our nation. I thank you for your attention. Arakoze cyane umushitsi wacu mukuru honorable minister Arabashimi cyane banyeshuri kubuye umutsi mugezeho ashimiye abarezi mwese abari nishuti kunkunga mwate bano banyeshuri yongeye kutugeza ingamba leta ifite kugira ngo umenye cyangwa uburezi butere imbere Ubundi abifuriza amahoro y'Imana n'imigisha myinshi cyane. Thank you very much Honorable Minister. Nyuma y'iryo jambo rero rikuru nta kindi tugiye gukurikizaho uretse kubaha amatangazo makeya dufite. Nyuma yuko Honorable Minister asoza uyu muhango ku mugaragaro turaza guhaguruka twese tuwongere turebe umutambagiro muko waje urongera ukomeze gutya na gusubira inyuma hanyuma turabanza honorable minister nabayobozi bakuru hanyuma hakurikireho ba principals hakurikireho abandi bayobozi batumirwa hanyuma hakurikireho abari mu ndibo bari bo mujinyuma Ladies and gentlemen, we are coming to the end of this function today, and I have a few announcements. As the Honorable Minister is going to dissolve this congregation, we are requested to rise up and go with the academic procession. It will go in the reverse way as it came. The academic mess will be in front of them. The Honorable Minister will follow with the dignitaries, of course, the principals will follow and all the other staff will follow in the academic procession. I have another announcement. After this, all the invited guests, we have got a cocktail. We shall pass through this entrance, sorry, exit, and you'll find protocol there to guide you on what is next. Another announcement is coming from the Rwanda National Police. They are saying, please don't drink and drive. With that, I would like to ask the people in the technical room to give us the song that goes with the academic procession. Thank you very much, everyone, for coming. Thank you very much for gracing this day. Congratulations once again to our graduates. And thank you very much, Rwanda Polytechnic, for pulling off such a magnificent event. Thank you very much. Okay. Sorry. Honorary Minister, you may now dissolve this congregation. Thank you very much. By virtue of authority and trust to me, I declare this congregation dissolved. Thank you.